Hey guys, welcome to another virtual pre-K class. My name is Mr. DJ and that was Leo that was just running around getting you guys all warmed up. Today our theme is called Three Cheers for Chores. We're gonna learn all about what chores are, but before we do that, let's play our drums and sing our hello song, everybody. See if you guys can sit on down and you and your family sing along with us, you guys. Have a seat, Leo, let's play our drums and sing our hello song. And it goes a little something like this. Oh, everyone, please play your drums and sing along with me. How do you do, everybody? How you do? How you do, everybody? How you do? Oh, we come to gym for fun and we'll get you on the run. How do you do, everybody? How do you do? I do, da do. Good job, everybody. <laughs> hey, so like I was saying, today our theme is called Three Cheers for Chores! 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 <laughs> Just like that. Everybody, chores are kind of like little jobs that you guys might have at home. Um, do you have chores at home yourself? I have chores. My name is Mr. DJ, and my favorite chore is to wash the dishes, to get the dishes nice and clean. <laughs> What's your name? My name's Leo. I'm seven years old, and my favorite chore is making my bed up. Making us bed up. That's and his favorite chore. And brushing my teeth. And brushing your teeth. So all those things that we named are different kinds of chores that you guys might have at home. Uh, we're going to see if we can have some fun trying some crazy chores around the house, uh, all while having a lot of fun. Now, one very, very important chore that we have to do, uh, that we all have to do, is to take care of our bodies. And by doing that, we can do some exercising. So we're going to get up on our feet here in a second and power our bodies nice and ready so we can have some fun, okay? Now, every time I say, three cheers for chores, we'll chores. put our hands in the air and say, chores, chores, chores. chores. <laughs> Let's try it. Are you ready? Here we go. Three cheers for chores! 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 chores. <laughs> Thanks, guys. And hey, by the way, make sure that you guys tell us uh, who came to class today. Uh, tell us your name, tell us how old your child is, and maybe even ask them uh, what their favorite chore is. And hopefully I can say hi to you guys as we're going through our crazy class today. So like I said, one very important thing we all have to do is to take care of our bodies. And by doing that, we can do some exercising. So we're about to get up on our feet and do something called the power up. Uh, me and Leo actually did this yesterday. So if you saw our video from yesterday, you probably remember some of the things that we're going to do right now. Okay. So remember, get up off your feet, make sure you're in a nice, safe place, shake those leg muscles out and get ready to power up everybody. Yeah. Are you ready, dude? Yes. Let's do this, buddy. Here we go. Kids, if you're ready to power up, say yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> we're going to count down from 10. Power ready? Up in 10. Two. Get the legs burning with frog 
Let's do some frog jumps. Don't forget to say ribbit. Hands down and go ribbit. 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 You're doing great, everybody. Ribbit. 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 Freeze. Don't move. Listen carefully. Listen. We're gonna do. Put one hand and one foot on the ground like this. And balance on one hand and one foot. And you can wave to a friend. Hey guys. Hi. Hi. Hi, friend. Hello. Hi. As you bear walk, lift up your hand once in a while. Oh, hey. a friend We're gonna five. bear walk this time. And if you want to, give somebody a high five when you're bear walking. to get some water now is a good time to do just that okay guys but you're doing a great job rolling through it everybody okay hey so let me see who all came today so i can say hi to my friends bum, bum, bum. all right uh-oh i see my friends juliet maya and eddie hey you guys it's good to see you i'm so glad you guys came to class today let's see uh-oh hey 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 avery hey ainsley i'm glad you guys joined us too Okay, now for this next activity, we are going to get a chance to do some really cool tricks with a stick. So if you need to take a second to find a stick, you can use something like, like wooden spoons or utensils, something what? that you can kind of roll around. Me and Leo here are gonna use uh, some swim noodles or softy sticks to do our crazy activities with. Uh, you can also use maybe an empty paper towel roll, something like this that you can use. There you go. Well, maybe you could use a yoga mat. <laughs> you should use a yoga mat? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. That might be a little tricky. I don't know. <laughs> but hey, whatever you choose to use, make sure it's nice and safe because we are going to be moving the stick around. We're going to be twirling our sticks. We're going to be maybe doing some crazy tricks like jumping over our sticks. You'll be amazed how many different things we can do with our stick, okay? Uh, all you need is a little imagination and some creativity, and we're going to have a lot of fun. But before we do it, Let's do our three cheers for chores. Oh, Cho yeah. oh we gotta say chores. <laughs> we'll try again. Three cheers for chores, everybody. Here we go. Chores. 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 Let's see what kind of chores you might do with our crazy sticks, everybody. If you're ready, follow along with Leo and I. We're gonna see if we can twirl our baton. Here we go. Gather all around. Hold on tight. The best in town. See if you can twirl it. Your hand. Round and round. Round and round. Good job, everybody. Move it up high. Move it up high like this. Whoa. Can you jump up and down too? Side to side. Now go side to side like this. Here you go, here, buddy. 
like you can lift your legs up and make it roll up to your belly. Tap it on my knee. There you go. Here, Cameron, tap your knees. We're your friends' knees. <laughs> Gather all around. Yeah. I'm the best in town. Hey, show us how you twirl that baton. Give yourself a big ta-da! Ta-da! Great job twirling that baton all those crazy ways. Let's see who else is here today. Emilio, I miss you, buddy. Hey, Emilio, I'm glad you came to join us, buddy. All right, we're gonna go into our next activity, and this time we're gonna do a lot more chores than that, than that last song. Now, for this activity, we're gonna get a chance to use our magic brooms, okay? Now, we, what you can use for your magic broom you can use a napkin, or you can use your stick for it to pretend that's your broom. You can use a rag as well. That can also be your magic broom. What me and Leo are gonna do, we're gonna take our pool noodles. Yeah. Oh, here, let's switch. Here you go. Oh, how about this? I know you like red. Oh, but, oh, oh. There you go. I'll take the green one. There you go. <laughs> we're gonna take our rags, and we are gonna see if we can try to stuff our rags inside that little hole of our swim noodle, okay? And when we do that, voila, it becomes a magic broom. Now, if you don't have a softy stick, you can also take your rag or handkerchief, whatever you have, and maybe tie it around a wooden spoon and that could be your magic broom as well. There we go. Hey, I have a question for you guys. Uh, is cleaning your room one of your chores at home? It's mine too. It's mine too. And Leo's as well. And it's a lot more fun to clean your room with a magic broom, don't you think? We're going to see if we can try to clean not just our room, but all kinds of crazy things with our magic broom. So if you guys are ready to rock out and have some fun cleaning up and doing our chores, let's hear three cheers for chores. Ready? Here we go. Three cheers for chores. 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 Great job, everybody. Hey, real quick, let me get a fist bump from you guys. Ready? Good job. Oh, the Muffin Man's here. <laughs> hey, come here, come here. 
Good to see you, buddy. I'm glad you came. I hope you got your magic room ready because we are about to clean up the whole universe. Uh-oh. Are you ready, guys? Are you ready, Leo? Can you help with that? <laughs> I got you, kiddo. Thanks. There you go. Daddy. Yeah. I'd love to see what you guys come up with to make your magic broom. So if you think you can, maybe even put a picture underneath this little video and show us how you made your own magic brooms, everybody. I hope you're having fun out there. Let's see what we're going to do with our magic broom. Hey, and in between, in between each of our segments, we're going to go to sleep on our magic broom, okay? So why don't we start by mm, taking a little nap, everybody. I, yeah, I'm sleeping. Lay on the ground and go to sleep. This is a magic broom. Put it on my pillow and I will clean up my room. Oh, we're going to see if we can use it to clean our rooms, everybody. Are you ready? Hold on tight. I lay down on the floor to sweep oh, under my bed. Go on, go on your belly and get under your bed. Oh, it's dusty in here. <coughs> Whoa. My bed is really dusty. Then I get up on my tippy toes hey. to sweep the cobwebs over See if you can sweep the cobwebs on the ceiling. Walk on your tippy toes if you need to. Whoa. <laughs> I sweep in circles. Can you sweep in a circle like this? I sweep the walls. Oh, don't forget to clean the walls up. Sweep those walls, they can get dusty sometimes. Oh, and a little Good job, this. everybody. Let's all go Until to sleep. Good cleaning, Avery. Way to go, Ainsley. Go to sleep, Muffin Man. This is a magic room. Put it on my pillow and I will clean a baboon. Wait a minute, clean a baboon? We interrupt oh, this listen. activity to announce that there are no baboons in this room. There's no baboons here. However, you can pretend that the teachers are baboons. What? You can clean them instead. <laughs> oh, not so fast, Leo. So, kiddos at home, you guys can pretend that your parents are the baboons and safely get your magic room ready to sweep them up, okay? Follow along with the music and see what you're going to clean. Here we go. Sweep off their toes. Get my toes, Leo. Pretty smelly. <laughs> Yeah. And up to their knees. Oh, can you get my knees, please? Thank you very much, sir. That's Sweet positive. their back. Can you get my back? And their belly. Oh, I can get my belly. But only if they say please. Hmm, please. please. <laughs> I got some jelly on my belly. Sweep their arms. Can you get my arms? Let me get that one. And sweep their shoulders. Oh, get my shoulders, too. Don't miss a spot. There you go. <laughs> and finally their head. Can you get your head? Ah! <laughs> Now it's time oh, to go back Thanks, Leo. to bed. I'm not smelling anymore. <laughs> Let's all go to sleep. Uh, it's awesome. This is a magic broom. Put it on my pillow and I will zoom on my broom. We're going to zoom on our broom. Everybody, climb on top of your broom and get ready to fly around like a witch. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Zoom all around the room, everybody! Woohoo! Yeah. I can zoom down low. Can you go down low? Go nice and low to the ground like this. There you go. I can zoom up high. Can you jump on it? Go up high! Whoa! <laughs> then I can land on my bed. <sighs> And shut my eyes. Hey, Eddie, Juliet, Maya, you're doing a great job, too. Keep on cleaning. This is a magic room. Put it on my pillow and I will clean the moon. Guys, we're in outer space, so everything moves in slow motion. the moon rocks. So, so slow. slow. I can sweep upside down. Can you sweep no. upside down? <laughs> what the? Big, long, slow strokes. <laughs> can you go in a slow circle? Yeah, big, slow circles. That's fun. Big, slow circle. Like now it's time for our nap. Go back to sleep, everybody. <laughs> oh, you two up the man. Go to sleep. This is a magic room. Put it on my pillow and myself I can groom. Hey, this one 
this time we're gonna clean ourselves. So everybody have a seat in a nice big wide straddle. Sitting on the floor with my legs spread out wide. You see, legs out wide. Wave your magic room in the air like this. I sweep the crows off my toes. Oh, get your toes, Eddie. Both right and left side. Get your toes. I sweep the fleas off my knees. Get your knees, Avery. Keep them straight, please. Keep them straight, everybody. I sweep the flies off oh, my thighs. Get those flies, Ainsley. Get those flies off your thighs. I sweep the potato chips off my hips. Uh oh, Juliet, you got some potato chips on your hips. <laughs> I sweep the jelly off my belly. Uh oh, Maya, get that jelly off your belly. I sweep the flibs off my ribs. Get those flibs, Leo. Wait. What in the world are flibs? I don't know. I don't know. Keep cleaning, though, everybody. I, I sweep the boulders off my shoulders. Get your shoulders, Muffin Man. I sweep the speck from oh, my neck. You better get your speck in your neck. Oh, you missed a spot. I got you. <laughs> get your neck. I sweep my face. Can you sweep your face? With grace. Get your face clean. <laughs> you better sweep the bear off oh, your hair. Get your bear off your hair. <laughs> Look at my hair now! <laughs> and sweep the willow from your pillow. Oh, clean off your pillow! What is it? Good night. Great job, everybody. High five, Leo. I'm sleepy. <laughs> You're sleepy again? All right, you can take a nap, buddy. <laughs> you guys are doing a great job out there. I wonder if we have any more friends that joined us. Remember, if you're watching, make sure you say hi. Emilio, great job keeping up with us too, buddy. Hey, this next activity is more of a game, okay? We're gonna see if we can play a little game called Simon Says. Do you know what Simon Says is? If you don't, I'll tell you the rules. It's very simple. Now, Simon Says is a game where one person, Simon, that'll be me, uh, will give you something to do, but you only do it if I say Simon Says, okay? If you, um, if you, um, if somebody else is, if there's about five or more people here, if, if you do what they do, something that that it, they didn't say Simon says for, you're out. Mm, well, you know what? For this game, you don't have to be out. If you make a mistake, that's okay. Just keep on going with us, okay? Now remember, don't do it if I don't say Simon says, okay? <laughs> Got it? We're going to see if we can clean our, uh, do our chores while we're playing Simon Says, okay? So listen up and follow along with us, okay? Are you ready? Okay, I'm Simon, so we'll go like this. Simon Says, jump up and down. You should be jumping. Simon Says, stop. Good job, good following. Okay, Simon Says, look at your body. Close. Simon Says, put your hands in the air. Simon Says, freeze. Simon says, bend your knees, stand up. Oh, I didn't say Simon says, you should be still bending your knees. Okay, Simon says, stand up. Hey, now that you've gotten the hang of it, listen carefully, I'm gonna give you some chores to try, okay? Simon says, brush your teeth. Simon says, wash the dishes. Can you wash the dishes? It's your favorite chore. That's mine. <laughs> Simon says, mop the floor. Can you mop the floor? Jump up and down! Uh oh, I didn't say Simon Says! Oh, I tripped you, Leo. Oh. <laughs> that's okay, buddy. If you make a mistake, remember, that's no big deal, guys. Just keep on going. Okay. Simon Says, brush your teeth. <laughs> Simon Says, walk the dog. Hold the leash and walk that dog. You are, uh, that's a big dog. <laughs> <laughs> Simon Says, pick up the toys. Huh, get down and pick the toys up from the room. Uh oh, I think Leo slipped on the Lego. Ow. 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 <laughs> Everybody lay on your belly. Oh, I didn't say Simon Says. Good job listening, Leo. Uh, Simon Says vacuum. So push that vacuum back and forth. It's a big vacuum. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Simon Says wash the dishes. Brush your teeth. Oh, I didn't say Simon Says. Good job, Leo. Uh, Simon Says mop the floor. Simon Says walk the dog. Simon Says pick up the toys. Wash the dishes. Wait a minute, I didn't say Simon Says. Okay, but Simon Says pick up the toys. Simon Says vacuum. Simon Says walk the dog. It's all the same thing. Simon Says mop the floor. Simon Says brush your teeth. Simon Says wash the dishes. Walk the dog. I didn't say Simon Says. <laughs> Five, buddy. 
Hey, great job everybody out there. You guys did an awesome job following along and that's a fun activity you guys can do at home all the time. Where'd my phone go? There it is. <laughs> all right, you guys. Hey, before we go, let's do one more three cheers for chores. Remember when I say three cheers for chores, we'll all put our hands in the air and say chores, chores, chores. Are you ready, buddy? Yeah. Three cheers for chores. Chores, chores, chores. Great job, you guys. Here, have a seat, puppy, buddy. All right, you guys. Hey, I want to thank everybody for coming out and having some fun with us in our virtual pre-K class. We miss you guys so much, and this is kind of strange. We don't get to see you guys uh, right now, and we're still having a good time together. So I'm really glad that you guys all came to do some crazy movements with Leo and I. Some things that you guys can do at home, these are called personal outside practice, or POPs for short. Your practice is to ask your parents what your chores are uh, and to ask them if you can help them with their chores. Leo sometimes asks me if he can help me wash the dishes and sometimes I let him hold on to the brush and scrub away some plates here and there. So you never know, they might let you, uh, uh, you know, take part in those chores, right? And sometimes I say I want to walk the dog with you. That's right. So see if you can help your parents around the house and boy, they would be so happy if you guys helped them with some of their chores, okay? Uh, see if you guys can do as many chores as you can and have some fun while you're doing it too, okay? Now, before we go home, or before we go, <laughs> we're going to see if we can sing a little song um, about washing our hands. Because washing our hands and keeping our body clean, that's what our chores, right, Leo? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, washing our hands. So we're going to listen to a song. It's called Everyone, Please Wash Your Hands. And we're going to see if we can wash our hands along with it, okay, guys? Okay, here we go. One, Are you ready? Two, Put your hands together. Two, three. Goes like this. Everyone at the little gym, please wash your hands with me. Wash with soap and water in the sink, please. Wash your hands and your fingers and your pinkies. Wash between every finger so the germs will never linger. Wash your hands and your fingers and your pinkies. And rinse them off good. Well, something that lingers means it stays around. So he's saying that make sure you wash between your fingers so the germs don't stick between your fingers anymore, okay? Now, let's see if you can try that one more time. Are you ready? Get ready to wash those hands. Wash them with me, guys. Here we go. Everyone at the little gym, please wash your hands with me. Wash with soap and water in the sink, please. Wash your hands and your fingers and your pinkies. Wash between every finger so the germs will never linger. Wash your hands and your fingers and your pinkies. And rinse them off good. Rinse those hands. <laughs> <laughs> Great job, everybody. Hey, one more time. Let me see if I can say goodbye to some of those kiddos out there. <laughs> Miss Melissa says, good job, uh, Leo, using your vocabulary words. And Muffin Man, you be careful jumping on that couch, buddy, okay? Make sure you're being very safe, because at the Little Gym, the number one rule is to be very, very safe, okay? Now, hey, one more time, guys. Thank you so much for joining us today. Before we go home, uh, let's sing our goodbye song. Ready, Leo? Let's see if we can sing those, play those drums and sing our goodbye song. Oh, everyone, please play your drums and sing along with me. So long, everybody. Thank you again for coming out today. I hope I see you guys again soon, okay? I miss you.